Good day, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to our exploration of the cutting-edge military technology of tomorrow. The Redback Infantry Fighting Vehicle, IFV, is an advanced armored vehicle developed by Rhine Metal Defense Australia. One of the primary strengths of the Redback is its advanced protection system. The vehicle incorporates modular composite and ceramic armor, providing excellent ballistic and mine blast protection. The design focuses on crew survivability, with enhanced protection against various threats, including anti-tank missiles, rocket-propelled grenades, and improvised explosive devices, IEDs. The Redback's advanced armor technology and blast-resistant hull ensure the safety of the crew in high-threat environments. The MQ-9 Reaper is an unmanned aerial vehicle developed by General Atomics Aeronautical Systems for the United States Air Force. It is a hunter-killer drone that can be used for both intelligence, surveillance, and reconnaissance missions, as well as for precision strikes against enemy targets. It is equipped with a variety of sensors and cameras, including an infrared sensor, a synthetic aperture radar, and a multi-spectral targeting system. These sensors provide the drone with real-time surveillance capabilities, allowing it to detect and track targets on the ground from a safe distance. The M2 Bradley entered service in the early 1980s, and it has been a key component of the U.S. Army's armored vehicle fleet ever since. It has also been exported to several other countries, including Saudi Arabia, which used the vehicle in the Gulf War. The M2 Bradley has seen combat in several conflicts, including the Gulf War, the Iraq War, and the war in Afghanistan. It has proven to be effective in a variety of missions, including reconnaissance, fire support, and infantry transport. The German Gepard is a self-propelled anti-aircraft gun system, specifically designed to provide effective air defense capabilities for military forces. Known for its agility and firepower, the Gepard is one of the most prominent and widely recognized anti-aircraft systems in the world. Its powerful engine allows for rapid deployment and maneuverability on various terrains, making it suitable for both defensive and offensive operations. The Gepard's mobility is a crucial factor in ensuring its ability to respond quickly to airborne threats. The Rafale is a twin-engine, multi-role fighter aircraft designed and built by the French company Dassault Aviation. It is a fourth-generation aircraft designed to replace the Mirage 2000 and the Jaguar in the French Air Force and Navy. The Rafale has been used in a range of military operations, including the French intervention in Libya in 2011 and the ongoing fight against ISIS in Iraq and Syria. It has also been used in air policing missions, including NATO's Baltic Air Policing Mission. The FEH-77 BW Archer is a self-propelled artillery system developed by the Swedish defense company BAE Systems Bofors. It is a highly advanced and mobile artillery platform that can provide accurate and responsive fire support to ground troops. One of the key features of the Archer system is its advanced automation and computerization. The howitzer is equipped with an automatic loading system that can load and unload shells in less than 30 seconds. The system's hydraulic suspension also allows it to be raised or lowered, depending on the terrain, ensuring a stable firing platform. The High Mobility Multipurpose Wheeled Vehicle, HMMWV, commonly known as the Humvee, is a versatile and iconic military vehicle that has been in service with the United States military since the 1980s. 
The HMMWV was developed to meet a wide range of mission requirements, including troop transport, cargo transport, reconnaissance, and weapons platform. Its design incorporates features that enable it to operate in various terrains and climates, making it suitable for diverse operational environments. The F-16 Fighting Falcon is a single-engine, multi-role fighter aircraft developed by General Dynamics, now Lockheed Martin in the United States. It is one of the most widely used and versatile fighter aircraft in the world, with over 4,600 aircraft built and operated by over 25 countries. The aircraft is also equipped with a range of air-to-ground weapons, including laser-guided bombs and missiles which allow it to carry out precision strikes against ground targets. It has been used in air policing missions, including NATO's Baltic Air Policing Mission. The ATAN, Hebrew for steadfast, is a wheeled armored personnel carrier designed and manufactured by the Israeli defense company Rafael Advanced Defense Systems. The vehicle was developed to provide the Israel Defense Forces with a highly mobile and well-protected platform for infantry transport and fire support. The ETAN has seen combat in several conflicts, including the 2014 Gaza War and the 2021 Gaza Conflict. It has proven to be effective in a variety of missions, including reconnaissance, fire support, and infantry transport. Boxer Remotely Controlled Howitzer RCH-155 is a German-made 155mm towed howitzer developed by Krauss Maffei Wegmann. It is designed to provide highly accurate and effective indirect fire support to ground troops. It features a modular design that allows it to be easily transported by a range of vehicles, including trucks and helicopters. It has a range of up to 30 kilometers and can fire up to six rounds per minute. The howitzer is equipped with an advanced fire control system that includes a laser rangefinder, a digital battlefield management system, and a navigation system. Designed and developed by Northrop Grumman, the B-2 Spirit first took to the skies in 1989. It's often hailed as a marvel of modern aviation, standing as an epitome of cutting-edge technology and strategic prowess. Its primary mission is to penetrate deep into enemy territory undetected, delivering a devastating payload with remarkable accuracy. With aerial refueling capabilities, this bomber can cover vast distances without the need for frequent stops. Such endurance ensures that it can reach targets around the globe, making it a formidable force in projecting power and maintaining a strong deterrence posture. The amphibious assault vehicle AAVP-7A1, commonly known as the AAV, is a versatile and amphibious armored vehicle used by the United States Marine Corps for expeditionary operations. Designed to transport Marines from ship to shore and provide essential firepower support, it is a reliable and effective asset in amphibious assault missions. This armored vehicle has the capacity to carry up to 21 fully equipped combat-ready Marines, including the crew. The K-2 Black Panther is a South Korean main battle tank, designed and produced by Hyundai Rotom Company and currently in service with the Republic of Korea Army. It is named after the Black Panther, a large cat native to the Korean Peninsula. One of the key features of the K-2 Black Panther is its advanced composite armor, which is designed to provide protection against a wide range of threats, including armor-piercing rounds and rocket-propelled grenades. The tank is also equipped with a soft-kill active protection system.
The Arian Smet UGV Unmanned Ground Vehicle is a cutting-edge autonomous robotic platform developed by French defense company Nexter Robotics. The Arian Smet UGV is a compact and highly maneuverable robotic system. It is equipped with tracks for enhanced mobility, allowing it to traverse challenging terrains, including rough and uneven surfaces. The vehicle's compact size and agility enable it to operate in urban environments, narrow spaces, and confined areas where larger vehicles may have difficulty accessing. The vehicle Bland de Combat d'Infanterie (VBCI) is a French 8x8-wheeled infantry fighting vehicle (IFV) developed by the French defense company Nexter Systems, formerly known as Giot Industries and Renault Trucks Defense. The VBCI is in service with the French Army and other countries, including Saudi Arabia, Qatar, and Cyprus. The VBCI is equipped with advanced technology and digital systems, including a battlefield management system, digital map display, and a satellite navigation system. The VBCI has seen combat in several conflicts, including the French intervention in Mali, where it demonstrated its effectiveness in counterinsurgency operations. Thanks for being a part of our military tech community. If you found this video informative and entertaining, please consider subscribing and leaving a comment with your opinions on this fascinating topic.